Hello friends, uh, I'm Parwez and this is our third video in developing the quick applications and QML programming uh, in Qt5. Uh, in the last video we have uh, covered uh, the basics of a window in Qt quick applications and QML. Um, this was our uh, first window. Uh, let me run this. You can see we have a window, we have a, a simple text, Qt quick application. And if I click on this uh, every sections, because it is the uh, mouse area is field parent, if I click the, uh, the window will be closed. Uh, and also we give uh, a width and height to our window and also a color, green color. Uh, this is the mouse area. Also we have uh, give color to the text. Uh, we make it visible also we give it a font family and font bold and also we give it a font size uh, today we are going to make our first rectangle in QML uh, for this uh, you can uh, in here you can add a rectangle okay give it an ID to this I give it uh, rect1 and also give it a width uh, of uh, 300 and height of uh, 300. If I run this, you can see that we have a simple uh, rectangle. Now it has a white color. I want to give it another color. For this, in your rectangle, you can simply write color and you can in the string you can write your color name I give it brown okay uh, now if I run this you can see that we have a brown color rectangle uh, now I want to position it you can see that it's in here I want to bring it in this section uh, for this you can just give it X uh, to 200 and uh, Y to 200. If I run this, uh, you can see uh, our rectangle is in here. But as you can uh, observe in here, uh, this is not s centered in a good position. I want to make it in this section centered. Uh, for this, you should remove uh, these X and Y coordinates you can simply give it anchor dot uh, center in and make it parent to the parent because our parent is window uh, if I run this you can see that our uh, uh, rectangle is in the parent uh, let me make it like a button no? uh, for this uh, you should uh, the width is good but no the way this I think I give it 250 it's good and change the height to 100 if I run this yeah now it's looking good but uh, just um, give the width the 300 is good like this yeah now it's go good uh, I want to give a border to this rectangle and I want to make this rectangle like a button. Uh, for the border you can give it border dot width. I give it it. If you run this. Yeah, now it's good. Now I want to give a uh, color to the border. I give it border dot color. Uh, make it blue. If you run this again. You can see that we have a blue border in here. Now I want to give a radius to this. Uh, we can simply uh, radius and give it uh, um, 10 will be good. Okay. Now if I run this. Um, not good. But uh, I give it uh, 50 should be good. 
Yeah. <coughs> uh, now it's so good. Uh, okay, guys, uh, this was our third video in uh, Quick applications and QML programming. Uh, this was uh, the basics. And if you have any question, uh, please let me know. And also, for the further videos, uh, please subscribe my channel.